I like that though. That's cool. I just I'll play it. Uh, N- Nintendo always has this hold on me because I gotta buy any yeah, Zelda game. So anytime it. something like this happens, like damn you, Nintendo, you win again. <laughs> give, me, give me the 25th anniversary where it gives me Wind Waker, Majora's Mask, and Ocarina of Time, and I'll be so. Oh my HP god, dude! Octopus. That'll total, total, be total, like. Total, bro. Hey guys, before we start the show, I'd just like to ask for your help in supporting Gamers Outreach and give a shout out to them for the beautiful things that they do. Gamers Outreach is a charity that helps make video games available and easy to manage in hospitals. Being in hospitals can be scary and isolating. Games help these kids access these activities, as well as a chance to socialize. Sometimes healthcare staff can even use games to assist with treatment. My favorite part of this program are the Go Karts, short for Gamer Outreach Karts. Each unit is equipped with a gaming console, monitor, controllers, and games. Go Karts help make these games easy to manage in hospitals, especially when kids are stuck in their rooms. Guys, let's help these kids be kids and have a chance to be themselves. Link will be in the description if you would like to support them. Welcome to Clutch Team Podcast, your one-stop podcast. What's up, everybody? Welcome to the Clutch Team Podcast. My name is Junior Silva. Today, I'm joined by Angel, a.k.a. Fear, what up, Fierce Deity, a.k.a. The Snore Lax, Lorlax. Lorax. <laughs> <laughs> I'm about the Lorax. I got you. I will lower, bro. Feed it to me. And we also got Corey in the house. AKA <laughs> Captain Core. What up, Core? What's good, everybody? What's good? Captain Captain. And today, we're just coming with you guys to chill. We're going to talk some news. There's a lot happening in the game world. And we're just here to give you guys that news. And that's what we're going to do. Should we start it off, boys? Send it. All right. Topics. Topic number one. All right, for this first topic, Skyward Sword, Nintendo's trying to hold the fast travel behind an amiibo. That's right, behind the toy. So you're gonna have to buy the amiibo to fast travel between the sky and the ground. Let me send this one to Angel, because this is, this is kind of ridiculous. The lore, yeah, hit, hit us with some lore, Angel, first, uh, for the for the players that don't know what, what Zelda's about. First and foremost, as you know, Link is one of the biggest icons in Nintendo. What they did here was they reset the timeline. So to those that don't know, it was originally Arkham the Time, broke the timeline. <clears throat> now it's a redone with the Skyward Sword. Now this whole amiibo thing, it has me in question. Why couldn't it be an item that Link could just find in the game? What do you guys think? Core, what do you think? You think this should have been an item that you find in the game? Well, you think? Purchase, you know what I mean? I feel like yeah, it's, 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 you know what I mean? I don't know. I feel like it's a microtransaction. Yeah, I, it is a microtransaction. Everybody's trying to get money in any way possible nowadays. You feel me? Like, we gotta buy a toy to go to the ground to the sky. Like, come on, man. This is Zelda. This is Link. We're talking about it. I'm I'm saying, bro. Like, first of all, let's go with the flute. Every game, let's go with the flute. Every game has fast travel. So why are you trying to make us pay for a toy to get fast travel for a game that you're already charging us 60 bucks for a remake that's just been like, really just been like graphically updated, barely. You know what I mean? Yeah, like, yeah, it's, it's like, it's not that, that much of a change. It, it looks great. It definitely- I mean, I, I love this game, don't get me wrong. This game was fucking the shit, but come on bro nintendo's always doing this bro oh, and you know why they do this because they know we're gonna buy it anyway because i'm gonna get it are you gonna get it you know what i mean like, <laughs> i'm gonna hate you right now they know you're gonna have that purchase on home that's why that's why we got tight because we like we know we're gonna get it but uh what do you th- so you thought it was gonna it should have been an item in the game angel it been an item found in the game i feel like you know it's, since they're giving you know the link you know that this whole week um c- come back to, to the switch uh, again it was originally on the week with nunchucks yeah just make it an item you can find you know a little add-on real quick for an amoeba i guess you know amiibos can't go out of style on nintendo yo that amiibo is probably gonna be a good collectible i'll tell you that yeah everybody's gonna want it everybody's gonna want it. drop in bread oh here's my whole wallet that's cool yes like you. like those joy cons i wanted to get the ones that look like oh, the sword the master sword those ones. are tough those I are fire yeah. those are tough 
Yeah. Well, Angel, you uh, you played the game. What do you think about Skyward Sword? Well, uh, I, I think that was unique that we actually get to relearn that the the Master Sword is actually the Skyward Sword. That is the sword that you wield. It's actually not the Master Sword. It's actually called the Skyward Sword. And then we actually see that Link, in, in every iteration, if you ever play uh, any of the old Zelda's, is that Link was always a different person or lived a different life. And this one, he's at a, an academy. So he actually knows how to use the sword versus to uh, Ocarina Time, just a child in the forest. Hell yeah, and this is, uh, for those that don't know, this is where the story started. It's the origin. Yeah, so, I mean, it was a good game. I enjoyed it. I'm happy to play it again. And, but this Amiibo, yo, bro, I sometimes I feel like Nintendo does this just to get, like, the, like get some back between the game. You know what I mean? Oh, like, yeah, like behind the game, like, like they want, they want this shit to go live and everybody to hate, so they, like, it's kind of like... Uh, it's like publicity, you know, like, yeah, there's no such thing as bad publicity, right? Like, not when it comes to the time. No, no. So they're just, That's they're just getting it out there and they're, they're geniuses. They're yeah. geniuses. They're running the show, man. They're running the show. Uh, ooh, right. here's, a, here's a side note. If this amiibo is allowed for this, you know, this whole feature, can this amiibo be allowed in Smash Ultimate? Smash Ultimate allows you to use amiibos. And same thing in Breath of the Wild. Breath of the Wild allows you to use amiibos to unlock treasure chests. Will that become a thing? Can you get a Skyward treasure? item hand hand nintendo from having this amiibo let's talk about that could happen give us some nintendo why are you trying to charge us for fast travel bro like can i use this amiibo in other iterations of your product why are you trying to charge us for fast travel i know i'm just i can't believe you charge for rupees not real currency rupees come on not real currency you're breaking here you're breaking here Corey, you played uh, Skyward Sword? You plan on playing it? Like, do I plan on playing it? You plan on adventuring the, the, this adventure? I ain't gonna HD hold it. HD too. HD. <laughs> HD. Yeah. You sold me with the HD. Yeah, barely. Yeah. <laughs> HD. Yeah. Bro, it's gonna look crisp. Uh, yeah, I don't think I'll get into it. I mean, Zelda has always been that character. He's been that character for Smash. He's been that character. Look at that Volta. Look at Zelda yeah. and Link. Zelda and Link, they look good too. Yeah. And then I like how the feature is. I'm not gonna lie, I like the joystick feature. We're, we're gonna it's stream it here tough. on the channel. We're oh, gonna stream oh, it. It's kind of tough. I like that. Enemies look a little funny, but. <laughs> <laughs> Big guys. It was like the the, the goblins, I think. Oh. But bro, it's just crazy because oh, like no. That. As soon as the sword, look at that. Yeah. I hope that yeah, it's yeah. better synced than it was on, on, the, on, on the Wii. If you remember on the Wii, you actually had a, I have the, the Wii Remote Attach piece at the bottom. You actually had them in the, uh, the, um, the advanced piece in order to actually have this feature. Couldn't do it with the basic Wii Remote. Oh, yeah. So we got that, like, extra, like... Beat, you know, like, you don't have to worry about Verticality, that. like... Yeah. It's kind yeah. of tough. I like it. You and, better shoot, shoot. and if you don't want to use the remote, they'll let you use the little joystick now, right? Oh, you can connect the... I hope they allow us to have the compatible with the other GameCube mode. See, like, somebody, a good example. Someone with the light will not have this feature, so they're going to have to use the joysticks. I don't mind that. Uh, yeah. well, the, I wouldn't um, mind that. The, um, the analogs. They will not be able to use... Oh, yeah, because the handheld... The, the other stuck. Switch, yeah, they're yeah, stuck. They're stuck yeah. So they have to play it like it was just like a, on a DX. You see? I like that, though. That's cool. I just I'll play it. Oh, Nintendo always has this hold on me because I gotta buy any yeah, Zelda game. So anytime something like this happens, like damn it, Nintendo, you win again. <laughs> give, me, give me the 25th anniversary. What gives me Wind Waker, Majora's Mask, and our good time, and I'll be so. Oh my HD god, dude, so that'll be cool, like, cool, yo, yo. So on, in the E3, something might happen. Because because this is Zelda's 35th anniversary still. Oh, because the Mario one just ended, so something still might happen. Okay. You know what happened? They did this for controversy, so everybody, so everybody, like, oh, let's talk about it, whatever. Like, they got us, we're talking about it, right? And then they're trying to build this up right before E3, before they, they cool it down, because they might give us, like Angel said, might give us a double pack, yeah, Ocarina yeah, of Time, Majora's Mask. Bro, some kind of remake, like they did for. Uh, yeah, a nice remake redone. I really want those joy cons. I'm sorry. Let me no, I want those joy cons oh, so yeah, bad. Dude, bro. I'm sorry. <laughs> they got us again, bro. Up. They got they us again. Uh, guy knew what he was doing. He knew what he did when he custom made those. Those things probably look a pretty tiny. He knew. You knew. Yeah, it's like you knew when you made it. Can I can I get a custom like dock with that? Like that like, would be tough. Oh my god. That would be tough. That's yo. That's good. Take my whole wallet. Just take it. 
bought <laughs> black after that repeatedly. Would you like yeah. my pink slip? Yeah, and Zelda, <laughs> Zelda's like the only game that you'd be like, all right, I gotta catch these bugs, but yeah, fuck it. Oh, it's yeah, it's fun, like, yeah. Bug catching was a thing for Link over yeah. the game. Yeah, and I'll tell you what, any other game that tells me to catch some bugs, I'm not doing that shit. I hold yeah. your horses, man. Zelda your horses. actually meant something. Well, like what game are you catching bugs? So no cap. No cap. Shout out to my shorty. Shout out to my shorty. She put me on to uh, Animal Crossing. You gotta yes. catch bugs, bro. Yes, you oh, Animal Crossing, gotta catch bugs. And it was, yo, that game goes hard. No yo, cap. I never played Animal Crossing. It goes hard. I never it played. goes hard. You start up your own. You run the show. I like that. Yeah, no, but Link, it, it, nothing was whatever without purpose in this game. Everything was like a mini game type thing. You know what I mean, like, you had to capture the bug, it had purpose. You know what I mean? It was just, oh, it's a random item in my inventory. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, right. You know, it had to be. Like, Link made sure everything that was in his arsenal had purpose. I like how he's an adult now. Yes. I like how he's, he's an adult now. He's I like, like how the story is. Yeah, Thank you. Nintendo for actually realizing we don't want to Straight play away from the kid concept, right? Yeah, it, always a child. I'm tired of playing with some little ass kid for like years. <laughs> like 11 years old, 10 years old. I've been playing with the same 11 year old Where's for 11 years. <laughs> Yo, what Ooh. about what about if they make remake Wind Waker though? Ooh, I would like to see that again. I Wind did, Waker. I did enjoy. Wind I don't Waker want a Wind Waker. If you're gonna remake something, give me the OGs. From Nintendo 64. Well, it wasn't to the past. Oh the my god, Ocarina of Time, bro. Ocarina of Time and Majora's Mask. That's the first game I ever Ocarina beat. Ocarina of Time, Majora's Mask. You give me those two. Yeah, that'll be sick. I dude. might trade in my P5. Dude, yeah. honestly, I'm gonna come out right now and say that if they make Ocarina of Time and Majora's Mask masks, a uh, hundred dollars. If they make it a hundred dollars for both games, I'll buy it. <laughs> I'll buy it. Just slap your wallet. No just throw it. your whole Nintendo, wallet. I'm just throwing that out there to you because I feel like everybody will do it. 35th anniversary. That's three games in one. Full send, okay. Nintendo. Send it, dude. Hell yeah. I like the shield though. I like how you can block. I, oh, like... yeah. You saw he had the wooden shield, didn't have the Hyrule shield. I like the Link always was able to switch his on gear. Yeah. Oh yeah, dude. And then yeah, he, he like see the like shield this. now. You see how he's got. And in this shield? game, you got like the double hook shot. You got like both hands with the hook. So you like, yeah. That's that, sick. That that's that tough. That All right. Sick. Yeah. All right, guys. We're gonna move on to the next topic. Finish. All right. Ah. For our next topic. Netflix wants to get more into video games, which means that all their shows that they got, they they got the license for them, you know, they want to make video games about them. Like you see the one in the background, Stranger Things. And uh, I'll throw this one to Corey. Oh. What up, Corey? What do you think about this? What kind of shows do you want to see be turned into games? Do you think this is going anywhere? Do you think Netflix is really going to do it? It's just like they're just, they're just dreaming here. Honestly, bro, the way this game looks, I like this. This is a, that old nostalgia feeling of Streets of Rage. And I I like Stranger Things. It was a good Hell show. Yeah. That Hell show, show had me on the show. edge of my show. seat. Every oh, season, I was like, oh, fuck is going to happen next? Oh. But uh, he was going through some things. Bro. Yo, oh, yeah, yo, yo. Can we cap it on him real quick. Yeah, that, that like they could, they could like literally if they really get more into it, they could like make different ones. Like like an old yeah, school one. Man. They could make like you know. And I love yo. This was this show was Netflix. I'm saying full send this idea. You have some good I shows. Agree. Great idea. It's blowing up. The game industry is blowing up right now. You can't get these new consoles. They know that they got money. Like they got money sitting if they don't do this because we're we're, we're, we're we're gonna get like the gamers are gamers are alive dude gamers are like we're we're up there dude like the game gaming world is 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 going it's, up it's constant just constant going up non-stop like, infinite market market. good way to put it's, it it's like you can marketize like a good example of, like this is a game based off a show we just recently seen a one two three seasons now to give it a flair they went above you gave it you know the, the old school graphics at the same time it actually looks pretty much fun for multiplayer you know get some yeah games. i mean the story period it, it, like yeah. these, these netflix shows totally got great yeah. stories so they don't even gotta worry that, about that there's already lore the, yo i'm not that. gonna lie this was my favorite like 
Netflix series. Yeah, yeah. Hell yeah. Was really this fun. had you on the edge of your seat. Are we, are we, the these kids were playing D&D, and they really went from a game that we're playing as a board game. They saw that, you know, things were really getting out of hand. Hell yeah. The beginning of season one. Hell yeah. Yeah, they were all gamers. They were just, yeah, game, there you go. They were all gaming children. Look at that. I mean, let me throw this, this, this at y'all, though. What about Karate? The Karate Kid. Uh, Are we uh, gonna see a Karate uh, Kid can I can see Cobra, Cobra Kai. Kai game. I can see Cobra Kai being a... Uh, a fighting game? No. I, I, can, I, can I can see them doing something like this. Like a Streets of Rage type of thing. That'd be nice. Like that? Like a story kind of thing? Yeah, Cobra Kai is like a Streets of Rage type of thing. I could see that happening. Use Hawk. Fuck shit up. Create a character, you know what I mean? Pick, 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 pick if you had a Cobra Kai or like uh, Yagi Do Karate. Hell yeah. Yeah, I can see that happening. They can really have potential. You know, Netflix got some shows, bro. Uh, I like how also Netflix, they did it instead of going one way with it, like how Witcher, the game Witcher. Yeah, that's what it was. It, went, it was originally game. game. That's right. And it was a Netflix. Then it was on Netflix for the show. So I think there's potential. There's much room for them. Because I'm, they have even animes on there. There's Baki. Baki, Baki is a, yo, a fighting Baki anime. is they a good one. They could make that into a, a, a fighting game. For you know sure. I mean? Baki is one of those games. You know? For I mean, sure. On Netflix. You know, Netflix has Castlevania, which is a video game turn into a tv show shameless so, shameless game shameless, shameless. <laughs> shameless. Yo, yo. like a mario party but shameless so much <laughs> <laughs> yo a shameless mario party perfect shameless mario. the shameless party the shameless party come on in that place take advice here the shameless here. party oh my god yeah shameless man this party one two and three that yo i'm down best. for that Yo, I'm so down, dude. I think they got so much potential here. Like, there's so many shows, so much story going on here. You, everybody has, everybody has Netflix. Like, come on, yeah, everybody has Netflix. You know, I feel like Disney, since Disney took over all those shows with Star Wars and Marvel and all that, they're gonna start going ham. Oh, we want to make games. our own games. Like, you know what I mean? We started seeing some Star Wars games. They're going to start coming back. So you guys better get ready for them Star Wars games. They're going to start coming back. And I feel like Netflix is like, hey, we're feeling left out here. Like, right. we're not going to let Disney do this to us. We're not going to let Disney do this to us. So I think that, I think we're going to see some games. I hope it doesn't fall like flat. You know what I mean? I hope it's just not like a dream, whatever. Like, uh, yeah, I'm we want to, but like we're not sure games. yet. Um, yeah, but they, what, what I also read about it was that they're going to, they're looking to hire people. So um, that's a big flag that they're gonna like really push towards this you know yeah yeah for sure okay. i'm hyped about it i'm hyped i'm hyped too yo i kind of I, I definitely want to uh, give this at least a shot i want to give it a try i yeah. like the way this looks too Especially oh, yeah. because like you notice like a lot of platforms are taking more indie games like this you know it's, it's like one of those major titles like when yo you see, that's like, a good point like it doesn't have to be triple a title no. it could just be an indie yeah, you know what i mean big thing right that's there. a big thing and then they don't gotta that's waste that much money on it they could just you make know make it multiple titles and not have to be triple a titles where these things are like really you know heavily invested games. hell yeah you don't really have to go that far you know hell yeah. just have a you know, fan base behind it especially like the netflix series fans see this like oh well, there's a game about my show i like oh i want to play it you know you track yeah i mean once they had the witcher they yes. took the game exactly. into which was also a book and everything but they took the, the game into netflix right and they were trying to do a Zelda series. I don't know if that kind of landed flat. I don't know what happened, but but like I mean, they're they've been dipping their toes in it, right? Like they yeah. got this game out. It's been, it's been a conversation. We definitely heard it over the years in Netflix. Well. Yeah, they're just like you no. Know, they they called Corey, and Corey was like, "Full send." Full send, baby. <laughs> <laughs> Hell yeah. Full send on Stranger Things. Stranger uh, Things four. Stranger Triple A title. Oh, I can't wait Triple for the show to come back titles. out. I can't wait for the show to come back out. I'm hyped. Dude, I know, yo. Yeah, yeah. COVID got everything like yeah. locked down, dude. All these great shows, like. I want to see a Witcher, Witcher season two. I would like to see what they do. Definitely. Well, and I, I don't like think I don't it. think Shameless just ended, right? Like, no, I, Shameless keeps going, man. Even through the pandemic, I think they got like a few episodes. I heard the I picture of the game, dude. I'm not gonna front, dude. That that show is epic as heck, man. I'm For not, sure, man. it's an epic TV show, bro. Funny. It's like real life The Simpsons. <laughs> 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 it's the real life. <laughs> <laughs> it's like family, bro. 
real life. Oh yeah, it's relatable. We're all right. Yeah. Now point. to the next topic. Next topic. Sinesh. We got. It. Oh. All right. Summer of Games is gonna kick off June 10th. IGN's answer. Which they also they also work with E3, but this is kind of like their answer. This is like they're them trying to start their E3. You know, IGN loves games. Shout out to them. They do their thing. But I'm gonna send this one over to Angel. Um, what do you think about this, Angel? Are you hyped about this? Is because E3 starts June 12th, That's so right. this is two a uh, couple of days before E3. Are you hyped for this? I would definitely say it's a hands-down awesome thing that they're actually choosing to give you a brief touch-up on information before you get that two-day effect where it's like, whoa, you know, IGN's about to drop their um, the, 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 the conference and conversation. Yeah. At least within on the 10th, you get a summary of what's to come. We already seen a first new amount of trailers. A good yep. example, Ratchet and Clank. That yeah. is one heavy anticipated game. That is a game we've been wanting to see for a while. And look, just look at the cuts right now. Like Ninja Turtle made a comeback. That's from if you guys remember back in the day as a kid, um, Ninja Turtles, uh, Turtles in Time, they even had on the GameCube. So to see a lot of games like that, even that martial arts game, that's an indie game. I love Ninja Turtles. We're gonna see a whole lot of action, even on the 10th before we smash into the 12th. I think it's gonna be a big Hell yeah. yeah, I think this is IGN just trying to kickstart because I think they're hyped for E3. Are y'all hyped for E3? For sure. You know, for so I think sure. I think they're hyped for E3. So I think this is them kicking it off. You know what I mean? Oh, like, look good. Oh my gosh. Uh, yeah, man. Like summer game fest, dude. Look at that. Yeah, bro. And so I got another question for you guys about the summer game fest. Um, because of all this lockdown and all this BS yeah. going on, you know, yeah. are we staying? Yeah. Are we staying with these online conferences? Are we going to get like the live, the live one yeah, back that right. we can go meet people and face to face? Because like I would, I want to go to those like oh, that'd be great. meet Imagine people. That. Just yeah, let's go to an actual E3. Actual an E3, E3, you know, E3 or is it going to, what do you guys think? You know, um, for safe, for safety reasons, I think they're going to play it safe. Safety Why first. And... Safety first, then teamwork. <laughs> <laughs> safety worse than teamwork, ladies and gentlemen. Remember yeah. that always. Yeah. So Wear I your mask. I think they're just going to be like, nah, we're going to stay home. Everybody stay the hell home. And just, there's no point at, you know, getting, catching risk. You know what I mean? It doesn't make sense to go ahead and have a room full of people again just yet. If, but if they do consider a small bundle group, can I have my camera? <laughs> or, or. It's like, can, am I allowed to stand 12 feet away from like the, the booth? I just want to hear. <laughs> <laughs> I know it's going to be a gnarly time. Yeah. Yo, I, I think I think we're going to start seeing some hybrid. You know, I think we're going to start seeing like they're going to yeah, allow yeah, a little yeah, bit of people yeah, go and yeah, they're yeah. going to do the rules. Small numbers, you yeah. know, you know, branched out. But you know, you're going to give us that numbers. like safety suit. You know, I mean, the, the alien one that you can cover your whole body. Only like 10 <laughs> people with hazmat suit. The hazmat suit. <laughs> yeah, like, no. They're going to allow 100 people in there with hazmat suits. And it's going to start off that you just move to the face shield and, you know, and while they're showing the online. And then I think eventually we'll move to where we have big groups again, but I think they're not going to let go of the online because you save them out of time and money. And like people don't have to go on trips anymore. It's just right. We're like it's more really convenient, love, you know, like, it's you know? more of a convenient thing for them. I, I'm pretty sure it, like and their speculation, they thought about it's like, hey, for the safety of the public and we still want to get our news out too, you know, so I think that's why they, they use so many live conferences since last year. I'm pretty sure they were sad that they couldn't have an abundance crowd to actually hear the roar when they were just like a good example. Elden Ring was an anticipated game. They didn't really get to see people go. <sighs> so it's like, yeah. you know, that, that that's something they miss. So, you know, it, it's got its ups and downs, you know? Yeah, when when Xbox had their uh, their little meeting and then Keanu Reeves came out and then that one dude was like, oh, you're breathtaking. <laughs> you're all like, breathtaking. you breathtaking. breathtaking. <laughs> <laughs> Keanu you know, Reeves. Stuff like that you're going to miss, you know? Yeah, exactly. You can't or, replicate or like that. When, like, you really can't. When these dudes, like, you got Elder Scrolls, you know what I mean? You got mm -hmm. Bethesda, another Xbox, part of Xbox, but you got Bethesda saying that, like, all these online Xbox games, and then party. people are like, Mm, they're like proud of your body and out of nowhere they'll they'll say like elder scrolls six and they'd be like ah, you know you, you get, you're gonna miss being like part of that like yeah no that hype yeah that you, hype you can't 
you can't re redo you, that. You can't recreate that through online. You know, it's yeah. just. You know. But you're better safe than sorry. You're right. You're better safe than sorry. You Why are better you, safe than sorry. You are definitely better. You gotta safe wait until things get back to normal. Why go ahead and be do? like this, the the source of why everybody got COVID all over again? <laughs> like, don't get me wrong. We want to expand the PS5 list, but we gotta wait, guys. I know we want to do it. We got a PS5. We itching, but we gonna get there. Yeah. Oh, yeah. oh man, I I'm super hyped to see what a couple games, but uh, I think my most anticipated game. I'm gonna have to be revenge with Ratchet and Clank. Yeah, Ratchet and Clank. That redone, yeah. Beating it, redone out on that. Bro, that Seems is like that looks good. Look, look at it. that, bro. Yeah, it looks so good. Halo also looks really good. Halo yeah, Infinite. Yeah, long it. anticipated wait for that game for Microsoft. Oh my God. The Chief is finally back. The Chief has returned. Master Chief. Uh, so, what I read online. What's up? What I read online is that some. They're gonna like. I think over 10 games they're gonna show. Like premiere, Ooh. are you guys hi hyped about that? Man. Tell me about that. <laughs> <Man. laughs> are we going to see things? Yeah, like I, I would. I first thought when I saw this, I was like, all right, they're gonna show us games, they're gonna raise up the hype level. But nah, dude, I heard this was gonna hey, be hey, like hey. a long event, and they're gonna like have a couple world premieres, you know. Oh. So I got hyped instantly over that. We we gonna be seeing some stuff. Let me get from you. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah. Something All right. Oh, I love that. We'll do we'll do a reaction video on that. I don't know if you're uh, ready for my reaction. I don't know if the screen is blowing. <laughs> it's not going crazy when that. Oh, I'm yeah. definitely like all of in. Oh yeah. All right. Oh. All right. Next, Next topic. topic. Yeah. Hey yo, June, send that. Sh send it. We about to talk some Overwatch. Some Overwatch. Get ready. We ain't yeah. never Overwatch. Get ready. No pressure. All right. Overwatch. So ah, so good. Is going five v five from uh, six v six. I want Corey, to talk about it. What do you think about that? Uh, as a person that played Overwatch when it first dropped, oh, I'm yeah. saying I pull it. Me and Ty the Trippy played that thing. When yes, Ty the Trippy dropped. I had no idea what I was doing, but I like the I like the energy I was getting from it. I like how you can have two selections of tanks, two selections of you know DPS, and two selections of healers. My boy Winston. From it to go backwards and take it away a whole two people, I'm not I'm not digging that. You know, what if I want my Reinhardt for a special combination I with mean. another tank? So now you're telling me, oh, oh well, figure it out. <laughs> like you're just taking away a whole other person's job now. At, you know, who does the Overwatch comps? Making offense the main. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like, why are they doing that now? So that means like less defense, more offense now. You gotta stick with one guy. Come on, you 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 you're doing me dirty here. Some people make a living, in, like pro players that are pro tanks, make a living. Like that's their bread and butter. Like they just probably feel slapped in the face. You know? For oh, sure. I I agree with you, man. Playing tank was my thing, man. I loved it. I had some yeah, crazy bro, when, DB when you're bombs. Like... Diva bombs were crazy. Angel too. And bro, then we both ran like I got my diva bombs. Like I can't be like your angel runs Zarya because you know. Yeah, it's not gonna be a thing anymore. You're gonna have to really switch up your strategy. Think about a lot of competitive teams that run off the double combo of using defense alone like that. They can't do that technique anymore. They're gonna have to run a whole new strat. And That's gonna Zarya, mess with a lot of competitive. Are you gonna make Zarya an offensive like a like yeah. DPS? I mean, how's that gonna be like? You know yeah, what I mean? Right? Like, and when you want to just chill, when you're like, all right, I don't want to do all this offense anymore. I just kind of want to chill and protect the other players. Exactly. You know, there's not be nothing. It's, it's, it's gonna definitely make the game more fast paced. Yeah, exactly. That's it's what gonna I be more mean. aggressive. You know, you can't really, you know, hold back for a defensive play at this point. Yeah, you get the intensity, but at the same time, oh, look at the Genji. What's good is that you just got one Ryan. You can't worry about an Arisa now. Like what? You know what I mean? Yeah. Like, yo, like how, how am I gonna counter that, bro? Like, you I know, play Arisa. Like, she's beast. Yo, I like she's to just hold back bro. real quick and just throw <laughs> some shield. <laughs> 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 she's fun. She, she's a beast, bro. Arisa, Arisa's up there, bro. I like using her too. 
two heal. How are you gonna have two healers? Winston's probably gonna be going crazy. Yeah, he's gonna go nuts. Uh, my brother told me. Because I have a long range uh, web. They got rid of. Yeah. They they added abilities like you can buff like it, it, it's, like, it's like a tree chart like in Destiny. A good reference to that is that it, uh, Overwatch Two now has a tree chart for the abilities, so the abilities cannot do more than just what they can do now. We we're, we're gonna see some new things. I think this is why they're messing with us because by remo uh, imagine a uh, six v six and all these abilities, I think it's gonna be too much. I think it's gonna be too much on the screen. Yeah, that's that. I think Angel makes a good point. I think like you know, the devs is not really trying to deal with that six v six. It makes their job easier. Yeah, five v five. That might be tough on. You know, because they don't gotta worry about so many players in the screen. Think about it. Now they could like make their game look better, minimize, make yep. the frames better. You know, framework is everything. Yeah, so I think less players in the screen makes like easier to develop. I definitely think that's a route that they it would probably is. There. It's probably light on the servers too. It's you know you're not having to deal with that person. Yeah. Who has bad connection one time or whatever? McDonald's Wi-Fi. Get off the Wi-Fi. <laughs> <laughs> Playing Overwatch in Walmart again. This <laughs> damn it, mom! You're looking at me. Hold up, bro. Let me take my Starbucks. Set. In the corner. <laughs> He's going yeah, all my brain. I also heard from my brother. He he's playing Overwatch on a PC. But he said that he's been watching some clips and stuff, and man, he doesn't freeze people anymore. Me? Me? <laughs> no freeze? Yeah, she well, doesn't freeze. She no beat her? No sub zero? She's she been watching the Destiny and seeing how pissed off. Right. <laughs> seeing the stasis it's flow. Like, you know what I mean? like, oh my god, this is what I've been doing all this time. It <laughs> really so, hurts. Uh, I'm such a cool person. Yeah, that's so crazy. May yeah. does not freeze anymore. That was her go-to. Winston gets a long range zap. Oh no. That's crazy. That's and awesome. this dude Reinhardt gets like two. You saw it? Yeah, he gets like long ass char like flames and he gets two of them, dude. Maduka. He's like Maduka. <laughs> <laughs> they're, they're gonna be really offensive, dude. This it's is gonna, gonna be, be different. Yeah. Ain't no more chilling. And no, I, it's not, yeah. No, I really just have not. like you got one guy to defend. Games are gonna get sweatier. Yeah. Yeah, yeah that's you course, are for real. For real. Fact. I don't know if I'm gonna like it. I don't know if I'm gonna like it. It looks it for so far. It looks it great. It looks great. For looks sure. looks great. Looks mean a lot, but at the same time, I like that six v six. Yeah, I know, bro. That's what Overwatch is about. Like you go to Destiny to play. That's true. Four v four, which I don't really like. That. Yeah, no, I don't like that. <laughs> I don't know why they got that. <laughs> you go to you go to Call of Duty, you get a, like whatever you want. Like, yeah, yeah. yeah you get everything sixty four versus sixty four. You know. Yeah. Four, four, yeah, that, that, and then here we go for our six v six. This is like a team. You know, they really perfected the whole. Oh, you gotta be a tank. You gotta be a healer. You gotta, you gotta like be a role to play. Yeah, yeah like you got your role, job. dude. And a lot, a lot of these players like took years and years to have these roles. But you, it's kind of like a, a, a slap in the face for them. Yeah, you know, I've been playing hands down. I've been really playing Overwatch since 2000. I want to say 15. My God, is it really that old? It's been a minute. It's been a minute. It's been a minute. Been a minute. Wow, this game is out of time. But yeah, it no, that is a ride to the Yeah, player. it looks great. I'm hyped. I'm hyped for more the story. Look way more. Yeah, I'm hyped to finally play some story. I do have one question. Will there be more story mode? Yeah. yeah. You know, is it just, you know, only all multiplayer, which has always been, will we get some story mode? Will we yeah, actually get yeah, some they, text and why, you know? Yeah, you know story, like... I want to know, I want to know more about Genji and Hanzo's fight, yeah. you know, why they fight, you know. The whole tree you know? that you were talking about, that's going to be in story mode. Like, all the abilities and stuff? Like, yeah, it's, it's, like oh, okay. The whole tree. They were trying to make it kind of like a... Oh. Uh, so if uh, we get some more story. Yeah, they were trying to like, really see. go into like getting different abilities modding mm -hmm. those abilities and stuff yeah because we never had that, hey, that was an rpg thing, yeah. rpg kind of stuff so you gotta so you're saying we have skill trees yeah dude yeah they got skill so trees, they're doing yeah. it like a destiny style well for like a good example you know how reinhardt does his uh hammer down yeah you can change how that works you actually she actually she has different ways of doing it. like when he does hammer down it's actually gonna look one or two ways different he's actually have two ways of doing yeah. it so it's gonna be you know a little a little unique on the battlefield yeah, I mean, so it's like you have two versions of a character it's like you can play this way using this uh, way of the skill tree or the other way you know what i mean so it's like a uh, competitive is going to be nuts because what if the person isn't maxed out you're going to have a bad one <laughs> you're not maxed out you're going to have a bad one but i'm pretty sure if everybody's maxed out it's going to be insane because everybody's going to be doing specials you've never seen before uh, a new ability pops up you're like oh piece of candy i don't know <laughs> you know what i'm saying i even know what's happening to it oh yeah I'm interested to see, but I'm 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 interested in this game. I'm not gonna lie. I'm interested, but I don't want to 
Just bring me back my 6v6, man. That's all I ask for. But... And it's yeah, like... Yeah, seriously, don't get rid of it. What's going to happen is, like, that is uh, Overwatch becoming Overwatch 2? Like, is that the same lobbies and stuff? Yeah, What's happening that's there? a question, man. Like, is this going to be different? Because you don't need the... I heard you don't need it's the game of Overwatch yeah, 1. Yeah, I think Overwatch just becomes Overwatch 2. Will that kill De uh, Overwatch 1 if Overwatch 2 comes out for, like, the competitive scene? If you think Yo, about it, will that not, die down the saying, PvP dude. aspect? You're right. Will that's, you just take away a whole tank? Dude, that's the problem and that's the solution the so check it so that's the problem and solution so the solution kind of for the players that love being tanks would yeah, be yeah. to stay on in overwatch original. one mm -hmm. and then you go play overwatch two if you don't really care or if you just want to try the new game well obviously everybody's going to try it at least yeah. but now nah, i think they're wiping overwatch Guilty. one that's yeah the I think problem. That's gonna be, uh the, the competitive so it's just gonna be overwatch two they just, just Overwatch 2, I think. Yeah, I think and then what's gonna happen? Overwatch 1, over it's gonna let it. Yeah, it's gonna sure. merge into two. It just so. merges like you, you're in Overwatch 1, and yeah, that's gonna Ryan Hart's abilities are changed. Yeah, it's gonna. And you go into PvP, and it's five v five. Rip, rip. That's what we're getting here. Yeah. Dang. Now, I think that's why they were like the heading was like, oh yeah, Overwatch is going from. Damn, that makes me wonder: will we get a dead server? Will we get a dead server for Overwatch 1 once this launches? No, I think it just becomes it. Oh, you know? oh God. Like, I don't think you could buy Overwatch 1 anymore. I don't think it exists anymore. It's just Overwatch 2. Imagine that. Yeah, dude, that's what I think. Yeah, that's yeah. What I mean. It's a good possibility, but, you know, Overwatch 2 just becomes more relevant than one just picks out. No, no, no. I think, like, when it comes out, I think Overwatch 1 becomes 2. Oh, like, like, strict merge? That's why Corey was saying, like, Corey was saying, like, you don't have to buy Overwatch 2 to go into the PvP. I think it just becomes it. Don't get, I, I might be wrong. Here, that'd be but, nice. No, no, no. That, that'd think, be nice. You know, so it saves you, saves you on, hold on, making copies. What if people don't like the 5v5? I, I, this is where I'm talking. Make it a big update. Right here, right? Make it a big update. The scene. Yeah. You have Zarya taking on. Like, yeah, you Multiple melted players, that. Multiple players, yep. You melted that. Uh... Yo, the tanks are going to be beast the first That's week. That's what I'm saying. Do you see they're gonna, that? They're not going to know how to that? control them. And then no, they're, they're just going to OP them. There's only one tank on the field, so he's got to be strong. Look yeah. at that. Yo, you see that, right? Zarya yeah. is mopping. Tanks are going to be bro. beast. Look at do that. you see this? Yeah. So, what, where does your second tank come in for the There's no such thing as a second tank. That's crazy. This is going to be tough, bro. Because how's Ryan going to combat Zarya? You know what I mean? Like, yo, he's gonna have a hard time, bro. Bro. This is and, gonna and be I, tough. But, but the on one tank thing fight. is that I think that the, the offensive players now and stuff, they're gonna get faster. Damn. Oh, he's right. You bro. know, tanks are gonna have, dude, they're limited time. Yeah, they I think they're, limited they time. said they're gonna get faster. Well, look at that. That's Zarya. Because look at that. Zarya's oh. eating him, bro. He, he, he has yeah. an Arisa or something like that. An Arisa would have backed him up, or, you know what I mean? So, like, like push oh, him back. Another yeah. Zarya would have been and pushed if, I mean, back. if you don't have these tanks protecting these healers either, you better start making the healers like that. I think they're gonna self heal. Thing. I think they're gonna self heal because. There's nobody gonna be protecting them. They're gonna probably play way back. I'm looking at this getting stressed up. I'm yeah. 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 This is making me deal with a lot of things. Yeah, all the the, 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 the healers, bro, because the healers are gonna be this, like, this whoa, gonna all this, all this offensive play happening. I'm not gonna heal, like, you know what I mean? Because they're not gonna have a second to the second they're gonna line dying, defense. They're gonna yeah, keep dying. Because as soon as I go down, the healer's already vulnerable, bro. He has no other oh. defender that will go hide behind. He can't. Yeah. And yeah, that's yeah, the only way you can rock a second. You're running hard, just going going him like a front line, yeah. Yeah, but you can go ahead and pull a second. See, look, look. One thing that I noticed too is when he pulls up the shield, he doesn't hold it. Yeah, he does. He only pulls it up for a little while. For a brief. Yeah, because he's going offensively. Watch. Yeah, see, he can't hold it over. Just kind of protect a little bit, but then he'll offense. You know. Look, he's having a struggle defending himself. I'm gonna show you. You're gonna really struggle. When I play Overwatch, Reinhardt got that shield up at all times. Oh, unless it's none of that on off. Nah, yeah, it's really not. Unless it's super sweaty and we really like everybody's like, oh, everybody offense, you know. Throwing up the shield like map rap and shit. Yeah, no, yeah, uh, if you're in a situation like that, for someone like Ryan, if he's going to do the the, the, the the in and out shields because he's under heavy attack, that means his offense isn't doing it. He needs a second defense. He will no longer have that anymore. So he's vulnerable. So if Ryan isn't walking with his unit, like a good example right there, Ryan is walking into that situation by himself. Bro, he's going to get wrecked. Yeah. He has no secondary defense. <laughs> You're dead. Ah, <laughs> oh, 5v5 is going to be so competitive, dude. It's going to be sweats. It's going to be oh intense. My. I'm not going to lie. Be threats, I'm, get I'm ready for the musty it. rooms. The musty rooms. I got ready. <laughs> Mad Axe, the order and spray in the room. <laughs> <laughs> Don't forget your Dio. <laughs>
Dude, look at him. Dude, look at him. He's getting, dude, that's like two on him, bro. Look at that. Bro, this is going to be hard, bro. I'm not going to lie to you. It's going to be tough. I'm going to test, bro. I do miss the second tank already. I do. I miss my second I tank. Know, I'm crying like... for it now. <laughs> I hope this is just like a temporary mode and like they keep like the other mode like as a separate thing. You know, like you have six and five. That's you a know great know what I mean? point. Yeah, yeah. Keep, have multiple keep, keep, modes. Keep. Why can't you do a, a 6v6 and have a 5 5 We so have our angel. six. Angel, that was yeah. perfect right there. That was so Slam. <laughs> Slam. Why hint, can't hint, you have blizzard? multiple modes? Hint, hint. Man. <laughs> for sure bro yeah. think about it. like come on can, can we have both can we just have both bro like i'd be totally okay with that i mean Damn, Lucio, when you play overwatch they have all these different modes right like they got like yeah. you could go in here and here and arcade yeah, no, they, do, yeah. they have Why random they modes. gotta make a big thing that they like straight up gotta erase i get it you're promoting your new mode but i'm not the best. <laughs> yeah right <laughs> it's like i get you're promoting your new mode but i want six though so, please yeah, yeah. I'm, I love Overwatch though. Yeah, I know. What, what, what I, do I love that's Overwatch. My that's my jam. I love Overwatch, but damn, do I get depressed playing. Please give us a lot more characters. Like, I want a big roster for Overwatch 2. Yes. More definitely. characters. You know what I mean? Please. Definitely. Overwatch 2. Come Overwatch on. 2. Full send the large roster. But you know what's good though? All right. The, the Overwatch devs and everybody behind guy. the scenes Batiste. they like they 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 hear us out you know what i mean they will they will like adjust if people don't like it and everything if if we all come in and say like hey some people if, if it's 50 50 the smart thing to do will be like angel said just bring back the 6v6 but keep the 5v5 because that might be dope yeah please it, it just does please, please the um at least and then make the it an event modes, player and then, skill and then you know what else choose you get to choose you want the right the old reinhardt that you get you know to be more tanky a, cla a classic choose right before the game starts right before the game starts choose which class you want you do you think they're gonna do that for the competitive scene though? no dude i think they're just straight up scrapping it so say That's yeah. the rank problem. matches i i, like I think 5v5 is gonna be your your competitive scene it's no longer gonna be your 6v6 yeah that's right. the problem that's why dude if it, you, like online right. people are bugging it's, like these not gonna these happen. tanks are bugging because that's what they do like some players are really they good at it, it. exactly so like, I love guys diamond tank. Rank just I, going I, I like tank yeah hell yeah i love it so i do you think they're gonna have an open cube still Oh, open and roll queue. That's right. That's a thing right now. Will, we, will yeah. that still be a relevant thing within uh, Overwatch? Should they use it as an experiment? Because we, as we know, people like to leave a match. You know, they're rage quitting. A little bit of criers. And they lose. What are you going to do? <laughs> you know what I mean? yeah, do we get rid what of do we do? You know I mean, you know, are, are, are we going to make it more stable? So that way, if players are having a struggling match, or let's say a player leaves, can he another player hop in to replace that? Like situation? skill base. Yeah. yeah or... skill base. Will it I mean, also make it so that thing. way the ranked, right? Because once you leave a rank, rank is tough. Oh my god, it's that's where the true catch penalty starts. If you that's leave, you catch penalty. Oh, yeah. So, so what happens if you got four? Four? Uh, I guess that's what it is. The five, right? You yeah, lose one player, but you still have four. Still got four. Yeah. Can they still fight? Still or DPS four, or four? They're all DPS. Two, healer, two tanks. Or two you know, saying like the, the game should pause the match within that moment to throw them in another player because otherwise they're going to be handicapped the entire time. Nine, time. nine times out of ten, once the match is handicapped, they leave. Nobody Bro, wants to fight. I'll tell you what. You know who's going to be the hero every game? The healer. Oh, if, yeah, if there's all this DPS still going on, day, man. still Bro, the there's all this DPS going on. The Look healer is going to change everything. I, I only play uh, tanks and healers. I don't yep. like playing DPS. Not my yeah, thing. I'm not a DPS fan. I like to use Lucio. Lucio is my main. Not my thing. Or Batiste. Like, uh, I'll rock. If I'm rocking tank, I'll do any tank. Any yeah, tank. Yeah, any rock. tank is fine. Except I'll for take. ball. Yeah. Y'all can wrecking have that Wrecking ball? Uh, I'm not really good it. with that durable looking thing. Y'all can have wrecking ball. <laughs> um, it's but a guinea pig, I think it is. For healers, I'll do pretty much anybody. I can run anybody. Yeah, healers. Yeah, healer, it could be anyone. But I, I prefer the two tanks. I prefer it. Yeah, man. It's just the game was good the way it was. It was. I didn't hear anybody having a problem. Who had this problem that they had to change? All right. Who complained? Who only heard about the sweaty? Who complained in the community? The sweaty. Five v five. No man. <laughs> oh, this tank. He just keeps holding his shield up. What? Too much pressure. <laughs> he was like tweaking behind the shield. Couldn't even get past him. It's like, come on, like whoever complains to the community clearly put this into play for their ears. They clearly said, okay, we'll go 5v5. Loki want to fight him. <laughs> for sure. Where'd you yeah, go? right. Loki. Couldn't have made it just 8v8? 
maybe. You know, so that's fight. not that's too intense. Well, that would that's be crazy. crazy. That would be, be awesome. That would be crazy. A mold, have all these different modes. Yeah. There you go. Uh, create a mode. Pick the rules. Yeah. Five v five, six v six, seven v seven, and have a limit. You know, you, you quit make that a creative mm -hmm. mode so that way it's not. I know it's not going to be a competitive. We all know it's going to be your thing is five, but we all know it should be a thing when it's non-competitive. I think you they're going to keep the competitive. You, you pick the amount you want to face. Yeah, I think, but I think they will. Overwatch is good with that. I can't yeah, lie. They're lenient. People sometimes like the open queue. Mm -hmm. So what, instead of the roll queue, you like being able to switch the characters. Yeah. So I'm pretty sure they might have a six v six. We I keep the six v six. You know what I, I mean? Five v you know I mean? yeah. five is gonna be their main focus for sure. for sure. But I think they're gonna do that. I feel like Overwatch Blizzard is pretty good when it came to Overwatch about listening to their fans, and I like how they also did the open queue. It's pretty cool. The open queue helped a lot. So I think they'll do like a six v six type of deal. Just and they just throw it oh, back. Yeah. And, yeah. Uh, Damn. Just when keep Hanzo scatter arrows away, please. And do you guys think we get a we get a release date during E three? <sighs> Blizzard Con, you know, or BlizzCon? Either, either or, you know, you gotta hear us, man. Can you give us a new character or something? I think E3, we get play. the release date. Release date. Because they got, what are they going to do something. for E3? They got to drop something in E3, gotta right? Yeah, they gotta give us drop another gameplay video. I have. They might give us They're definitely going to drop a cinematic real quick, a oh. little piece of the story. Give yeah. us a little tidbit. I feel like it'll come out within next year. Yeah. Sure. Next year, the beginning of next year. Um. Maybe uh, summer don't next tell year. me fall summer uh summer fall uh, uh i think april that'd be sad sad face. drop right there april real quick april in the summer everybody's so itching to play the new one and they just you to know see the... that's a good call that's a good question right before the next e3 you know or or, or just ah uh, that'll be that would suck but just wait to the next e3 and just drop it right there and you can play it right now you know what I mean? Yo, by that, right when they, they talk about right, it. Right, yeah, right. Perfect. What do you got? Is that Carlos? Shout out to Los. Oh, uh, what up, Los? Big Los, baby. Big Throwing Los. it in the chat. Uh -huh. so we got we got Deano in the chat. What up? What up, D? You uh -huh. in there? Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. What up, nigga? It's Drop the names. The Drop the some dog. names. The dog Shout father. The quick. dog Kowski. Write some questions. We might do some questions in the end. You, you know, know, so, so, you know, so, so some questions. questions. We still got a couple news pieces to get to get to yeah and speaking of news pieces Woo. let's get to the next one send that sh destiny 2 vault of glass is live is we're not playing it right now but not right now not right now right now later later the whole world is but all right the whole world is. <laughs> We're gonna get to it. We'll get them. You know, Angel. I'll throw this one to you. Ah, Warlock. Talk some vault. I remember when I was just a filthy casual man. Dro God. Drop a little lore. <laughs> drop a little lore. A little bit lore from the Lorax here, man. <laughs> My God, man. Once upon a June, man. <laughs> this guy he took me through the vault of glass, man. It, it was a tough experience because this was one of the first raids that Destiny had ever dropped. It was vanilla Destiny, by the way. This is the only way you could actually know you were exclusive to hit level 31 or 32. You would know if that person was if he had raid gear. Only way you would know. You cannot hit the slight level in the way you were stuck at 30. So when we went through there, I actually got an icebreaker weapon we will not see in the in the redo of the Vault of Glass. I'm I, tight. I'm sad. I'm <laughs> tight about that. That was my jam. And uh, yeah, take it away, Zuna. Uh, we will not see my favorite uh, hand cannon. Speaking of icebreaker, this dude, Angel, his first raid when we ran that. Dun, dun, dun. This dude, Angel got it in his first run. I was we were like, it. what? <laughs> Yo, my man got the icebreaker in his first run. I didn't know what to do with it. Oh, man. I didn't know what it was. I was looking at the sniper. Out of I nowhere, he just went from a simple Destiny player to regen, uh, regen life. ammo. <laughs> and every time he was sniping, it was regening into the chamber. Five in the chamber. Yo, I think, I think it was insane, bro. Like, you guys gotta understand. Re regenerating ammo with a sniper with no range, it has no limitation. 
You could be across the map and I can still hit you. Exactly. It was exactly. insane. Exactly. It was insane, dude. Yo, Angel got some crazy videos. Hell yeah. Love, June got the the one weapon that we're all looking for, though. The Vex Mythical Class. Vex Mythical Class. It's back. I got Guess it when back. it was troll. Yes, it was back. When it Guess was troll. You just two shit. Just, <laughs> just taking people out in uh, PvP. Two piece kill. <laughs> <laughs> everybody crying everybody crying when you just oh, got that dude, quick so kill broken. and so at that broken. time i was a terrible uh crucible player terrible at pvp but i wasn't <laughs> terrible with the vex myth though uh, <laughs> killed all day trolls trolls dude, that got another something, comment man. Right. that guy was something bro it really core was. Are you happy? Are you excited about this? You're the the highest level here. Yeah, new guy. What's going on, new guy? Overpower that. Beast. Me. Climbing Over. up the ring. Ah, yeah, look at this guy. Lord Salad and Son, man. I tell you guys, man. <laughs> I met this guy in the past, man. I knew his papa. We ran, we ran the rise of iron. We ran the ball of glass, you know what I'm saying? And I know I ran into his young puff son, but look at this cat, bro. Strong in Destiny too. Look at this kid, man. Shout outs to him. Captain Corp. All right, I'm not going to cap. I've been getting a little sweaty. Armpits is just getting a little musty playing Destiny here and there. I can't yeah, hold it. Um, I'm 13, 18 14. right now. Rip, me and Angel haven't even reached the 13. I know, I'm 1280. I feel so low. I'm an old man. I'm in my prime. I'm in my prime. About to hit 13 <laughs> this week, though. Hell yeah. <laughs> Got to. But, uh... I'm, I'm hyped for this man I'm, I'm hyped we get destiny has gone through a huge change with the stasis back how does it feel like a, a question for you guys how do you think stasis is gonna play out now with the bolt of glass this do you think it's gonna be we didn't have that before. great we didn't think about question we didn't think about it yeah dude that's, that's a good question you got stasis um, now you got shit. those crazy ass grenades they got now you Stasis is different. Stasis that power is different. Wow. That's true. I I personally think that people are probably gonna go in there with some bolt, uh, with some uh, uh, the dark class. Yeah, dude. Because of the shields and stuff like that, mm -hmm. you know. So the void. Good for the admin. I think. Void. Yeah, I think we're gonna like people are gonna start going in there with the void. But you're right. With stasis, you can start freezing everybody, yeah, slow it down, down a little bit more. Yeah, you could. Add clear with it. That's a different vibe. Going stasis to does class. a great job with add clear. How will that I hold up against power, the oracle? Think power, about it. How will how will stasis hold hold up against the oracles when you actually had to head into that situation, that particular situation? How will stasis do for you when we have to deal oracles? Does it even hurt the oracles? Does it even phase them? True. Dang. Yeah, I do. I don't know. That, that Titan super, that Roman super, definitely on the Titan slam was always go to back in the day for those little bastards. You know, you, you had to have somebody who was quick with the sunshot to put um those guys out, all those little uh yellow little uh, beacons that were called the oracles. These guys were bad enough as it is, but stasis, bro, that power is, is a whole different ball game. Walk into the ball glass with all new power. Hell yeah. Um, I'm kind of upset. I thought that like all weapons were gonna come back, you know, and that's what's kind of pissed me off a little bit. Let's see what happened with what they try to make us buy. <laughs> you know, that's another question. It's Destiny, like, bro, like if you start throwing like stuff in there, like remember, remember when uh, you did Vault the Glass, you got that white. What's it? I think it was Chatter White. Yep. Or some. They better not make us buy that. All oh, that, like, I'm gonna right. be tight, you yeah. know. You better just get that as a drop. And I wish they brought like some guns back, like uh, the Gallahorn. The Gallahorn, if you know, <laughs> I miss you know. so much. If you know, he bored. All he could do was a uh, hard mode, hard mode for his Vex Mytho class or for the Icebreaker. No, these were weapons you can't get from normal, that you had to get from defeating Atheon. Had one of you got that random godly weapon, hard mode got you Vex Mythical class. They got you Gallahorn, but you had to, one of you got it. It was a roll of the dice. So whoever got it, he was a lucky guy, man. It was just, it was, you had to be there, man. It was an experience. Yeah, <laughs> the yeah. nostalgia. Ah, oh, dude, it was breathtaking, yeah. bro. I mean, that's also good if you weren't there because now you got a brand new raid, technically. Mm -hmm. right? like, yeah, because they, they weren't there. Yeah, it's a free raid. Too. It's a free raid. There. Free raid. Can't go wrong. Gotta pay for it. Finally. Did but, you say free? But I think you got. <laughs> <laughs> it's Destiny. Nothing's free. And all right. <laughs> Nothing's free. You know, here. They make you pay to level up. I know, right? <laughs> Stop. Oh, my God. But yeah. Well, 
I, I'm hyped for this game, man. I'm hyped to play. I'm hyped to play with my boys in September. Yeah, cross play. I'm a cross, cross platform play. to my boys on PC and Xbox. Don't think we forgot about y'all guardians. Yo, we, we coming to y'all dimension, bro. Present. Yeah, PS5, baby. <laughs> All the guardians under one household. Under one household. Shout out to you scalpers that don't allow us <laughs> to get these PS5s. You are the scum. Dinkleberg. <laughs> Freaking you, Dinkleberg. The Dinklebergs. <laughs> the Dinkleberg squad. <laughs> the Dinklebergs. <laughs> Yo. I'm, I'm... Shout out to you, Scalpers. Hey. Help my boy get a P5, man. Seriously, hold P5. it down, baby. Give Stuck me the price. PC. Let's talk money. Come on There's now. Crypto, what's good? All right. I got something else to say about that PC, all right? I got a little rant that I would like to uh, take out right now. Bunch. Preach. What is happening? I used to play on PS4. I bought the DLCs, mm. all that. What do y'all think happened when I got to PC? What do y'all think Bungie did? <laughs> Any guesses? Rebuy. Any guesses? What DLC? Debo. What DLC? Debo. They said what? you got to rebuy everything. Even though you could just bring your character over you ain't bringing no dlcs over hell no that's money that they lost they would lose for sure you know? so you gotta rebuy every single expansion shame, bro. Bro. Shame. shame and what sucked is that an xbox it was part of the xbox pass the game pass it so was not yeah, it was, it was. Yeah, and that's right pc has the xbox and nah they it wasn't in there bro microsoft can we talk about that y'all got the ultimate pass on xbox y'all say it's I compatible y'all pc you. what's going on b I blame Bungie. What's going on with y'all? Maybe Xbox that's didn't a little allow sus. it. Yeah, yeah Microsoft, Microsoft that's allow a, it. It's a little sus, bro. But it's supposed sucked. to be on PC, man. Not liking that. That sucked. I'm going to go back eventually to PS5, though. That's where the clan is. That's where the boys are at. <laughs> if the scalpers let go a little bit. Just a smidge. Just let it go, man. With your bots. <laughs> All right. With your Vex. I'm sick and tired of your Vex bots. <laughs> Buying up all the PS5s. Hogging up all the oh, vets, pal. the hog mall. <laughs> all the pig feet. I want some pig feet. I swear, man, y'all scalpers, man. Y'all, y'all like Vex in here, bro. No wonder why we Destiny vibing, bro. Y'all interdimensionally taking PS5s. <laughs> interdimensionally taking PS5s. <laughs> it's not even fair yeah. anymore, man. Throwing them in, throwing them in the portal. And uh, I'll save it for later. Yeah. Throwing them to that eBay portal with your thousand mm dollars. Mm-hmm. Get some glimmer, I see. <laughs> you know what I mean? Getting some glimmer. Guess how you feel playing Destiny, man. It's it be hurting feelings, bro. It's like a bad yeah, see, it, it, Bro, that game works 30% of the time. All, all the time. time. <laughs> <laughs> you go into a crucible match, you think you're gonna win. Not today, baby. Connection server is destiny. And it kicks you right out. Sad slap. Don't get me started, Angel. Don't get me started. Bro, bro me and my brother try to do another bad right here, bro. We're trying to do some Iron Man, bro. For some reason, check this out. I'm running this on an iPhone. An iPhone stream. And it's streamed perfect by myself. Oh, the minute what? he tried to play with me, won't let him. He's running with an Ethernet cord. We could run strikes. You could run Cosmo drone. The minute you try to do PvP, yeah, splash now. <laughs> it just took it away from us. Well, like, I don't understand. So, we, is that why y'all game went free? Tell me the truth. Tell me the truth, Destiny. Y'all need to fix y'all servers, man. For sure. Fix them, John. Fix them servers, man. Fix I love y'all game, but y'all gotta fix them servers, man. Y'all got precious DLC, man. Y'all can't be doing this. And them PC players, stop cheating. Yeah, I haven't dude. seen it a lot lately. It kind of got better, but we know y'all out there. Y'all out there, man. We know y'all aiming that doing. shotgun way low and getting headshots. We see you. Yeah, man. The slide shot. Boom. Look at that headshot. Headshot coming about. <laughs> nah, come on. I see that way too often in the Crucible. Oh, my God. Way oh, too yeah. often. It, it's I, got me so wrong with that. Uh, I'm up there. catching me across the map. Beep, 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 I'm up beep. there. I can't it's lie. Gone. I can't lie. I'm up there in, uh, with my, my light level. I'm up there. Compared to these guys, 
No, bro. No, you can fight. You are able to place in Trials of Osiris. This dude can fight in Trials of Osiris. I can't even do that yet. Yeah. I'm over here in Iron Banner. I feel like Corey is like the best PvP player out of us. Told you, no. bro. I think, I, don't, I think. Angel, you the best? I was once. <laughs> Before I took an arrow to the knee. But, you know. <laughs> Man, I used to be a great warrior once. But, you know. Uh, I took an arrow to the knee here. Yeah. I've been playing it heavy. I'm, I'm about to get a Hanzo arrow. Yeah, right. Yeah. <laughs> Just dropped yeah, over. Oh, we got... Where's my healer? Aimbot. Yep. Oh my gosh. Definitely got hit with an aimbot for sure, bro. <laughs> for <laughs> sure. We were hit with an aimbot, bro. I'm aiming at his waist. <laughs> 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 Dude, come on. You're aiming at my torso. You hit me in the head. Come on. Yeah, yeah. for sure. If you want, you can add us. We can play with y'all. Oh yeah, feel free. You want to add us? You want to play with us, guys? You want to join us in Overwatch or any, any competitive gaming bombings? Yeah. We'll be streaming a lot more. Indeed. We have graphics people working on everything right now. We're really passionate about this, and I'll drop my. We just so passionate about video. We're passionate gamers like you guys. We'll also have other stuff other than gamers. We're gonna talk. We're gonna talk some anime. We'll talk music, movies. We'll talk everything. Anything. And everything you know and uh angel where can they find you bro yo if y'all want to find out some loony stuff i have a fine bro i'm a soul series series fanatic you can always check me out battle highlights on youtube or what ups fierce Deity at twitch.com you can always find out <laughs> come check me out so smooth man the fierce deity Fierce yep. Deity. We'll have them here Fridays for Fierce Deity Fridays. Fierce Don't y'all worry about Friday that. Friday frenzies. <laughs> <laughs> Captain Core, where can we find you? Tell them, Captain. This is your captain speaking. Um, captain Knuckles. <laughs> <laughs> I, I mainly am on Twitch here and there. Um, either that, or I'm riding with my boy Junior. Uh, I'll present. Hollywood go. Uh, I, I rock with the Twitch. I'll do a little bit of YouTube, not too much, but uh, I'm on P5. You guys want to play? Uh, I drop my name, my uh, tag in the uh, in the chat. Uh, June, where can we find you? Yeah, where can we work? find you, where, bro? Where you know, we enough about you? us, but where? Yeah, where can we not find you, my dude? Anytime you need somebody, Clutch, you can look up Clutch Team uh, podcast. Well, I'm on YouTube with Clutch Team Gaming right now. Gonna start popping off with some more uh, YouTube pages. I wanna open up, uh, there's a website coming where we're gonna help people find the cheapest games. You know, we're gonna have free beats for people that wanna be also creators that wanna have beats to use on your YouTube or your streaming. Uh, we will have that out soon. We're working on all that. And uh, just look up Clutch Team Podcast. I'm sure you'll find us. Usually YouTube is the best go. We're gonna have the podcast going on soon where you can just hear us wherever you are and you drive at work and everything and just stick with us we'll, we'll grow with y'all we love y'all we want to play games with y'all and that's it this is clutch team work i hope y'all appreciate yeah. it man day one, Check day, you know? day one Yo, shout out to shout out to all the clutchers out there man, shout out to all, all y'all man behind the scenes, appreciate like y'all for watching man, man. Yeah. behind the scenes up, carlos man we see you google, we see you, google nigga well, we ain't forget about you yeah i know we know you out there the dog house doodle smooth doodle the you og were you were there holding it down for getting on mics right you know uh, yeah about the shorties shorties bro shout Ooh, out man. to uh eric e dub e voice when y'all hear that welcome to clutch team podcast very white voice that's <laughs> that next time on dragon e ball z voice e <laughs> yeah next episode <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah no. he's the man uh yeah dude, dude, smooth bro smooth oh for all my uh uh, football lovers out there American football we're gonna have some fantasy football advice I'm gonna show you guys how to take that chip home like I took last season I don't wanna brag but I did anyway <laughs> no, it's up. Yeah. I don't wanna brag I got no. that trophy it's them bracken bits no uh yeah we got I'm a hype I'm hyped to for the future progress I'm hyped to pull some couple of you on the show on the podcast you know Smooth, you gotta hop on for the football one. I don't Smooth. care. Yo, got to, Definitely man. Live long and prosper, bro. We're gonna need you on here, bro. Also uh, part of the Carlos, team. Carlos Music and Movie yo, Mondays. Don't forget about that, yo. Music Mondays. Yeah, we're gonna have some jams, yo. Carlos, bro. Definitely bring the heat, bro. Tune in, guys. We're gonna have a nice schedule for you guys so you know when we're going live. 
and we'll post it go to twitter check us out on twitter at clutch team cast and we'll always post it when we're going live i'll do a couple shorts on youtube letting you guys know when we're going live and everything too because this is fun this is what we love to do yeah, that's what we live for to sure do, we love y'all you know what i mean Yo, I can't love leave games oh, just like you that. love games. We love anime, oh, like some of y'all love anime. You know. I hope y'all love anime. Y'all gonna disrespect me like that. You know? <laughs> Shout out to One Piece. One Piece. Catching up. I'm catching up. DBZ making a comeback next year. Y'all oh, seen that? DBZ. That little trailer. You know I mean, 2022. I don't want to say that. But DBZ. Yeah, 2022. DBZ. Find out next episode. You know what I mean. Yo, June, you gotta start streaming on this. At gameplay, not just podcast. Y'all gonna see the main event play, man. Duh, don't even think this man, you know, he he the Joe Rogan here, but you know, he gonna see him clashing <laughs> okay. games, bro. You gonna see this nigga clash, bro. Probably Trust get me. some Resident Evil going. Oh, get yeah. some Village going. We haven't even seen yeah. that. Hey, that I've is. I've been playing some sure. Cyberpunk, but I I don't know if I'm the holding Keanu, on. By the Keanu, you know. I don't know if I should hold on to the Cyberpunk, but I got. It's, it's a, a dead 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 good game, bro. It's, 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 that's a solid it's a game. It's got different dead endings. <laughs> It's got different endings, man. You, you, you got to give it a try, bro. I, I played Cyberpunk. It's actually. a dead game. <laughs> Who's up still? But yeah, if you're watching on YouTube, don't forget to subscribe for more content. Hit comment, that like button. Smash. Comment, comment, comment. Let us know what you guys think. Let us know what you guys feel. Let us know if you guys want to troll. It's, 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 it's up to you. Know, you know, what's, what's up with the world, man? Oh man. Hope y'all enjoyed it, man. We really appreciate y'all. He said no cyberpunk, it's dead. Damn. Oh smooth. yeah, and that's it sucks. <laughs> smooth with all hey, smooth. Yeah. Keanu Reeves was in it, man. He made sure you was breathtaking. Would you say that smooth? <laughs> Would you say that smooth? <laughs> He's got two Destiny does in his suck. <laughs> yeah, Destiny does suck. I can't hold. Yeah, go cap, man. Well, I mean, it just keeps bringing people back, though. It brought keeps me back. Bringing you back. So for some reason, you can't stop. Can't stop. That's the only stop. bad relationship yeah. I want is with Destiny. Back for Blood October. We will see that later on back in October, though. Blood. That won't come out this uh, in this June. I'm sad to say we'll see it in October. But Back for Blood, man. That's something Hell that yeah. y'all definitely want. They'll have the local play, and we'll probably be oh, streaming nice. here. Us, like you just know. First time demo on the consoles. That'd be sweet. Yeah. Imagine doing actually drop that. That'd be sweet. And it's same creators for Left for Dead. So yes, it is. Same makers. I, I, Great name too. I know, Back, for Back, Back for Blood. Back for Blood. Fantastic, fantastic name. Bro. Left for Dead. Can't yep. go wrong. It Yo, great. Man. It really did look good. So it's one of those games you guys might want to check. And out I actually over. missed Left for Dead. I oh I missed I know, it a lot. Yeah, dude. That was one of those games extra. that was really good for you. Know? I think everybody had it. Everybody you know, played party it. Party play. You know, it was it was that vibe. That four man yeah. rolling through the trenches, rolling through, throwing the. Oh, who's gonna Fight who's bomb. gonna who's gonna shotgun the witch? She crying and we're like, oh, no, nah, don't go there, man. I got it. It's a Billy now. <laughs> so who's got the medic pack? Yo. Oh man, what memories? Defibs. I know the defibs. <laughs> Bringing it back. And number two was my it? god. Yeah. yeah, dude. Yeah, Life or Dead Two had the defib leaders with the yeah. uh, gentleman rush needle. Yo, shotgunning the witch or sniping the witch, and then she running out here at full speed. <laughs> Yeah. But you, you know, you just oh, you God. Hit you. <laughs> <laughs> my God, oh, those yeah. are heart pounding moments, my dude. Like, yo, the witch was heart pounding. Scared out laughing, seeing the witch first time. Hell yeah, dude. You, you hear her crying, you're like, oh, oh my God. And then her music. <laughs> <laughs> like, oh. you, and you think you're saving her? Hey, miss, are you okay? <laughs> Coming here to find you. And turn around, she's over there. <laughs> Oh, you're ripping you apart, little. Do you know you thought you were doing something great for yourself? Don't be a hero. Don't be a hero. All right, don't be a hero, bro. Wilson. <laughs> <laughs> Definitely ended his life, bro. That didn't work out in his favor. You know what I mean? Shout out to Back for Blood. I would like to see that, man. That's that's a game I hope they do pop in on E3. Definitely. Uh, Definitely. We yeah. need that. We that do. has that has the fan base right behind it dude oh, like you know I, i'm there i'll be there <laughs> <laughs> oh but yeah i'm in there for uh for that game uh that's one game i definitely am definitely hyped for ratchet and clank this year oh that one back for blood Hell yeah. i'm not gonna hold you 2k Y'all, if y'all knew better, he would do better. So what about 2K20 head? What about God of War Ragnarok? 
Are we getting anything from that? I'm interested. Are we getting anything from that? That is a good conversation. Yeah. They only, they only said that we're gonna talk. You know, they're gonna show like a little bit of artwork. That's all they show. Like they really talk about what they're gonna, what's gonna be the thing about Ragnarok. But uh, I was talking to Cars prediction. Maybe it might be like midway we get to play as a trash as an adult. Maybe you know, maybe, maybe. adult Atreus. Or it's just gonna be an, another big trilogy before we see his son actually become his father, like his father, or maybe different. Who knows? The new ghosts of Sparta. Yeah, he might be the new ghost of Sparta, or he might. Maybe not. they go to hell to try to get the mom back. Oh, Kratos oh, saying no. Kratos saying no, like oh, stranger to going into hell real going quick. Going to Helheim, bro, to get the wife back. Yo, that might be a thing. Who knows? Damn. A good prediction for Ragnarok. Hell yeah. Yo, man. Let us know, know what you guys think in the comments below. That you know that that is that is something to think about. What will Ragnarok have to happen in the future? That's gonna be a good game. That series Definitely. has been going on. That series has been good though. That series has been good. Wow. Damn, Angel, you just Whew. sparked my brain real quick, bro. Like a... You definitely aren't sober thinking about that shit. Yeah. <laughs> 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 Spirit water. <laughs> hey yo. Alright. Alright guys. We're gonna this clap concludes, out here. man. This concludes our thanks our everybody show. for tuning in. Thank you for everybody who, who, who tuned in. Appreciate you guys. Hope yo. to see you guys again. First of many. First of many. First you are now many. part of the clutch team family. Clutch team you are family. now super clutch. Alright. Peace. Alright, peace. Get a pad here, y'all. All y'all scram. Let's get them.